This procedure will assist you with assembling the Wayland Timbercrest desk. To complete this procedure, you will need a hammer, a Phillips screwdriver and the included glue and hex wrench. Optionally, you may need a cloth. Warning, do not use power tools to assemble your furniture. Power tools may damage the parts. How to use the dowels. A small amount of wood glue must be used on both ends of the dowels. Insert a dowel about two-thirds into the edges of a panel. If necessary, tap the dowel lightly with a rubber mallet. Note, it is very important to use glue with dowels. Excess glue can be wiped off with a damp cloth. How to use the cam lock system. Cam bolts must be screwed down flush. The arrow in the cam lock must point toward the hole in the edge of the board. After assembling the boards, turn the cam lock 180 degrees clockwise using a screwdriver to secure. The boards or panels should be flush and tight after assembling. Note, do not use an automatic screwdriver to tighten cam locks. Do not over tighten. Insert 6 small cam bolts number 11 into the drawer front H1. Complete this step two times. Note, assemble the unit on a carpeted floor or the empty carton to avoid scratches. Attach 1 drawer right side H4 and 1 drawer left side H3 to the drawer front. Secure them using 4 small cam locks number 10. Attach 1 drawer bottom support H5 to the drawer front. Secure them using 2 small cam locks. Attach 1 drawer bottom panel H6 by sliding it into the grooves in the right side and left side panels. Note, ensure the panel slides all the way into the grooves. Attach 1 drawer back panel H2 using 4 M4 by 35 mm screws number 12. Note, ensure the drawer bottom panel fits securely into the groove of the drawer back panel. Secure the drawer back panel to the drawer bottom support using 2 M4 by 35 mm screws. Attach 1 handle number 14 to the drawer front using 2 M4 by 14 mm flat head screws number 13. Complete the previous steps for 1 more drawer. Insert 16 large cam bolts number 2 into the bottom surface of 1 desktop panel A. Insert 2 large cam bolts number 2 into 1 desk side panel E. Complete this step 2 times. Insert 4 M8 by 30 millimeters with dowels number 3 into 1 desk side panel E. Complete this step 2 times. Insert 3 large cam bolts into 1 desk back panel C. Insert 8 M8 by 30 millimeters with dowels number 3 into the desk back panel C. Insert 1 large cam bolt into 1 desk right front panel D. Insert 6 M8 by 30 millimeters with dowels number 3 into the desk right front panel. Insert 2 M8 by 20 millimeters with dowels number 4 into the front face of the desk right front panel. Insert 1 large cam bolt into 1 desk left front panel I. Insert 2 M8 by 30 millimeters with dowels number 3 into the desk left front panel. Insert 8 M8 by 30 millimeters with dowels number 3 into 1 left partition panel F. Insert 6 M8 by 30 millimeters with dowels number 3 into 1 desk right partition panel G. Attach the left partition panel and desk right partition panel to the desk back panel, C. Secure the desk right partition panel, C, to the desk back panel using, 2, large cam locks. Secure the left partition panel to the desk back panel using, 
one, large chem lock. Note the location of the slide openings on the partition panels. Attach the desk right front panel, D, to the desk right partition panel. Attach the desk left front panel, I, to the left partition panel. Secure the desk right front panel to the desk right partition panel using, 1, large chem lock. Secure the desk left front panel to the left partition panel using, 1, large chem lock. Making sure the large pilot holes on the desk side panels are facing upward, attach, 1, desk side panel, E, to the desk right front panel and desk back panel. Attach, 1, desk side panel to the desk left front panel and the desk back panel. Secure, 1, desk side panel to the desk front right panel and desk back panel using, 2, large chem locks. Secure, 1, desk side panel, E, to the desk left front panel, I, and the desk back panel, C, using, 2, large chem locks. Gently turn the desk assembly upside down. Attach the desk assembly to, 1, desktop panel, A. Secure the desk back panel, C, to the desktop panel using, 4, large chem locks, number 1. Secure the desk right partition panel, G, to the desk top panel using, 2, large chem locks. Secure the desk right front panel, D, to the desk top panel using, 3, large chem locks. Secure, 1, desk side panel, E, to the desk top panel using, 2, large chem locks. Secure the left partition panel, F, to the desktop panel using, 2, large chem locks. Secure, 1, desk side panel to the desktop panel using, 2, large chem locks. Secure the desk left front panel, I, to the desktop panel using, 1, large chem lock. Attach, 1, desk bottom panel, B, to the desk assembly using 20 M4 by 35 mm screws, number 12. Be sure to use a small amount of glue on the exposed ends of the wood dowels before attaching the desk bottom panel. Attach 1 metal bracket, number 16, to the desk bottom panel using 2 flat washers, number 7, 2 lock washers, number 6, and to one quarter of an inch by 18 millimeters bolts, number eight. Attach one desk side frame, U, to the desk bottom panel using two flat washers, number seven, two lock washers, number six, and to one quarter of an inch by 30 millimeters bolts, number five. Attach one desk long stretcher, Q, to the desk side frame, then attach, 1, desk back leg, S, to the desk long stretcher. Secure the desk long stretcher to the desk side frame using, 1 1 quarter of an inch by 18 millimeters bolt, number 8. Secure the leg to the desk long stretcher using, 1 1 quarter of an inch by 18 millimeters bolt. Secure the leg, S, to the desk bottom panel using, 2, flat washers, number 7, 2, lock washers, number 6, and 2 1 quarter of an inch by 18 millimeters bolts, number 8. Attach, 1, desk short stretcher, R, to the desk side frame, then attach, 1, desk front leg, T, to the desk short stretcher. Secure the desk short stretcher to the desk back leg, S, using, 1 1 quarter of an inch by 18 millimeters bolt, number 8. Secure the desk front leg, T, to the desk short stretcher using, 1 1 quarter of an inch by 18 millimeters bolt. Secure the desk front leg, T, to the desk bottom panel using, 2, flat washers, number 7, 2, lock washers, number 6, and, 2 1 quarter of an inch by 18 millimeters bolts, number 8. Carefully set the desk upright.
insert 13 large cam bolts number 2 into the bottom surface of 1 return top panel J insert 1 large cam bolt into 1 return left front O and 1 return right front P insert 2 M8 by 30 millimeters wood owls number 3 into the return left front and 2 M8 by 30 millimeters wood owls number 3 into the return right front insert 2 large cam bolts into 1 desk side panel E insert 4 M8 by 30 millimeters wood owls number 3 into the desk side panel insert 2 large cam bolts into 1 return left side M insert 4 M8 by 30 millimeters wood owls number 3 into the return left side insert 2 large cam bolts into 1 return back panel L insert 6 M8 by 30 millimeters wood owls number 3 into the return back panel insert 8 M8 by 30 millimeters wood owls number 3 into 1 return right partition panel N and 8 M8 by 30 millimeters wood owls number 3 into 1 left partition panel F attach the return right partition panel and the left partition panel to the return back panel note the location of the slide opening on the partition panels secure the return right partition panel and the left partition attach 1 return right front P to the return right partition panel and 1 return left front O to the left partition panel note ensure that the small pilot holes in the bottom edges of the return right front and return left front are facing upward secure the right front panel to the return right partition panel and the return left front to the left partition panel using two large cam locks attach one desk side panel e to the return right front and return back panel attach one return left side m to the return left front and return back panel note ensure the small pilot holes in the desk side panel e and return left side m are facing upward secure the desk side panel to the return right front and the return back panel using two large cam locks secure the return left side to the return left front and return back panel using two large cam locks attach the return assembly to the return top panel j secure one desk side panel e to the return top panel using two large cam locks number secure the return back panel to the return top panel using three large cam locks number one secure the return right partition panel in to the return top panel using two large cam locks secure the return left side m to the return top panel using two large cam locks secure the left partition panel f to the return top panel using three large cam locks secure the return right front p and return left front o to the return top panel using two large cam locks attach one return bottom panel to the return assembly using 16 m4 by 35 millimeters screws number 12 be sure to use a small amount of glue on the exposed ends of the wood dowels before attaching the desk bottom panel attach one return side frame w to the return bottom panel using two flat washers number seven two lock washers number six and two one quarter of an inch by 30 millimeters bolts number five attach one return stretcher v to the return side frame using one one quarter of an inch by 18 millimeters bolt number eight carefully set the return assembly upright attach the return assembly to the desk secure the return left side m to the desk using two flat washers number seven two lock washers number six and two one quarter of an inch by 30 millimeters bolts number five secure the return to the desk using two flat washers 
two lock washers and two one quarter of an inch by 18 millimeters bolts. Secure the return stretcher to the desk front leg T using one one quarter of an inch by 18 millimeters bolt number eight. Attach two cable wheels X to the desk back panel C using four five thirty seconds of an inch by 12 millimeters bolts number nine. Attach one cable wheel to the return back panel L using two five thirty seconds of an inch by 12 millimeters bolts. Note, you can use the cable wheels to help keep your entertainment center's cables and cords organized. Pull out the bottom left and right side partition panel bearing cage rails and slide the bearing cage on each side all the way forward. Align the left and right slides on the assembled drawer with the bearing cages and push the drawer carefully inside until it stops. Note, if the drawer does not go in smoothly, please take it out and repeat the step. If you need to remove the drawer, Please follow the instructions in the next step. To remove a drawer, pull the drawer out until it stops. Push the plastic release lever simultaneously on both sides. One side will need to be pushed up and the other side will need to be pushed down and pull the drawer all the way out. Insert one grommet number 15 into the desktop panel and one grommet into the return top panel if necessary. The height of the floor levelers may be adjusted by twisting them clockwise or counterclockwise. Congratulations, this completes the assembly of the Wayland Timbercrest desk.